Um, I haven't done too many epic rap battles of history on the channel. I don't know why. Maybe because I've been around YouTube for long enough to remember when they were like when they were on the rise when YouTube wasn't the way it is now. It was just it was just YouTube, you know, but super dope concepts. The music videos or the videos, I guess the edits are crazy. There's a lot of production behind the scenes that you don't even realize goes into these videos. So super excited. I asked people that, you know, what they wanted to see first. And obviously, coming hot off the trail tails of, of uh, Trump. And then we got Sleepy Joe in the mix in the Oval Office as we speak. We did it, Joe. Couldn't do not do this one first. Follow your boy Instagram, Twitter, Twitch. We do a lot of these videos live on Twitch. So if y'all guys want to see what like the behind the scenes of recording a video as I'm recording it for YouTube, consider joining over there. But other than that, there's really nothing to say. We got Joe Biden versus Donald Trump. Epic rap battles of history. Uh, let's get it. Hey, who had the fly on their head? It wasn't Biden, right? It was uh it was Pence. He had the fly that the internet went crazy over. When I saw that happen, I was like, the world is about to explode right now because of this goddamn fly. It's the DJT getting it on. The Teflon Dawn on the White House lawn. Can't <laughs> like you, I'll win a third turn. Your campaign's like your family. Crash and burn. Take looting and violence will keep. Not bad. The way that the uh, whoever's rapping is talking isn't bad. Oh, in a third turn. Your campaign's like your family. Crash and burn. Take looting and violence will keep the MAGA movement quiet. <laughs> Resist me? That's a riot. Why'd you step behind the gym? I'll be standing by. See how tough you are against the 45. Uh, I should have hoped uh, for your home party. Bigger than the one I blew through because I'm Solomani. Uh, uh, then I go and bone on Milani. Uh, I'm going to smash you, Joe. Like China. I've got all the best. China. We're doing many great deals. We're doing deals. It's some of the best deals that the world has ever seen. We're, we're doing great things with China. Then I go and bone on Milani. Uh, I'm going to smash you, Joe. Like China. I've got all the best cognition with all the top grammar. I'm Bro, that's one of the things whenever Donald Trump was a, was our president, right? I was like, I feel like people might be a little more receptive if he didn't just have the vocabulary of a third grader. The, the first thing that you learn in English class, especially if you're talking about upper level like college classes, is that the word very and the word extreme should never be used in your vocabulary. They are way too overused. And Donald Trump was like, nah, I'm the leader of the free world. I'm going to say very as much as I can. I feel like if he was just a little more eloquent, I feel like if he just had a little bit more swagger, people would have been like, all right, it's just whenever people not in the United States see this dude talk. It's like, there ain't no way he's talking like this, right? But to be fair, when Biden goes off script, motherfucker is a wild card. Who knows what he's going to say? With, it's a lose-lose. Like I've got all the best cognition with all the top grammar. I'm not a little <laughs> girl's shoulders, so you can't touch this MC stammer. I'm not a little girl's shoulders, so you can't touch this MC stammer. Sleepy Creepy Joe. <laughs> Yo, it was kind of weird, though, the, that little interaction right there, because the girl's like, uh, get your fucking hand off of me, please, sir. Shoulders, so you can't touch this MC stammer. You're a disaster inciting hysteria. You say I'm selling hate in America. You're selling hate in America. Like with Hillary, the uh, people aren't swayed. Just for our shadow. And I don't really like the shade. Oh. Now we're getting into, into the thick of it. Y'all remember when that was the meme? He said, you say that I'm selling hating in America, while on your side, you're selling hating America. It's a bar, guys. I don't like the shade, and all you are is the shadow of Obama. You only got elected because you were Obama's VP. Damn. There's some bars in here, bro. I don't really like the shade. The pain of losing loved ones is something <laughs> I have seen. So I know how you must have... Oh, not this accent. There's something I have seen. So I know how you must have felt when they killed Jeffrey Epstein. Ooh. Right there. <laughs> This is about to be rough in the comments. She, I'm going to begin the Republican Tom McDonald fans out here just disliking the video because they think that I'm hating on Trump and Biden. I don't like either one of them. You know what I'm saying? But that Epstein bar was kind of crazy. Kill Jeffrey Epstein. Ooh. Rap lyrics just ain't for you. You should stick love letters for Kim Jong-un. Uh, no wrestling here. Nothing about just real. Bitch, you didn't even really write the art of the deal. But you tapped in.
You didn't even really write the art of the deal? Knowing the way that Trump talks, I can kind of see how he might not have written. He might have had the ideas. You know what he was? He was the CEO of the book deal. He was the one with the ideas. And then his board of directors was like, we can't let this motherfucker write this book, but his ideas are decent enough for a book. So let's get other people to write it. It's, it's like Cardi B. You know what I'm saying? There ain't no way Cardi B writes her own lyrics. Have you heard the way this bitch talks? Ain't no way. Bitch, you didn't even really write the art of the deal. But you tapped into the rage, red mad hatters. Well, let me tell you, Trump, all lies matter. Uh, I don't want to deep. Is that what they called them? The red mad hatters? That's pretty solid. Like Mad Hatter, like you're out of your fucking mind, like in Alice in Wonderland and the red hat, the MAGA hat. I never heard that before. That's actually pretty solid. The rage, red Mad Hatters. Well, let me tell you, Trump, all lies matter. Uh, I don't want to defund no police. I picked a DA for my VP. I'm not hey. a communist. I'm not a socialist. I'm just an old ass man with some decency. Wrong. No matter Wrong. what you <laughs> Have pulled out of stormy daniels we actually just did the jubilee video on stream where it was like a uh, global warming scientists versus skeptics and it was pretty it's the same thing that almost happens with global warming they don't get anywhere even in that video the common ground video they didn't get anywhere it's the, everybody always talks about it at high level because nobody knows what the fuck they're talking about really you know what i'm saying global warming You're fired, Donald Trump's slogan from the show. I'm tired of you, Donald Trump. You're fired. The only thing getting fired on my watch is tear gas from law enforcement. Uh, I'll keep America great. You'll unleash your teeth fun. Keep America like Portland. Ain't nothing gonna be. Keep America like Portland. Bro, Portland is the wild, wild west for liberals out there. It's crazy. America great. You'll unleash your teeth fun. Keep America like Portland. Ain't nothing gonna be me. No person, woman, man, camera, TV. The only way privilege I see are those teeth. Maybe teach your son a thing or two about life. Like there's no hunting season for your dead brother's wife. You and your <sighs> Oh my god. Getting personal. I feel like he's talking to him, but he's really not. They aren't even real. <laughs> like there's no hunting season for your dead brother's wife. You and your mask and your night rider shades are getting <laughs> the fuck. Like your rovers is way. There's no blue oh. wave. Forget it, not coming. Like I tell criminals, Joe, stop running. Must be honest. Y'all remember when he said that? I forgot. Did he tweet it? When did he say? He said, we're coming after you. I forgot exactly what he said, but he basically called rioters criminals or, or protesters criminals. I forgot exactly what he said, but he's referencing that. And then obviously the Roe versus Wade, that Roe versus Wade went in the position. It's using the position for the liberal mindset toward abortions. That's why he's using it there. Joe, stop running. Was Brianna Taylor running? Hmm? You dog whistling fool. I think your daddy would finally be proud of you. He was a racist asshole too. Uh, What's this malarkey? Oh, you oh, it's because he got hacked by the fucking Russians, bro. I thought I didn't know what was happening. I thought this was a cut in, in the video and these were like the editors. <laughs> Watch this malarkey. Oh, you Keep at it and you'll end up in jail, hoss. I'll take it down like a mule and you're a mailbox. Before we keep going, one thing to know about me, I absolutely fucking hate being called either a hoss or boss. Oh, I fucking hate that. Hey, uh, you need a check, boss? You ready for your check, boss? Keep at it and you'll end up in jail, hoss. I'll take it down like a mule and you're a mailbox. From all your wives to the SATs, everything you ever did, you just had to cheat. Cause you're too insecure to even look like a loser. You're the worst damn Republican since Herbert Hoover. When you scooped up a sycophantic overvote loser. Remember came the Constitution's domestic abuser. 200,000 deaths like... Constitution's domestic abuser? Like you're abusing the Constitution by misreading it and putting it in the ways that's gonna, uh, like it's gonna benefit you? Sycophantic overvote loser. Remember came the Constitution's domestic abuser. 200,000 deaths lying at your door. You think they're suckers like McCain in the Marine Corps. Sometimes I can't <laughs> tell for which side you're rooting. When we go high, you go down on Putin. Uh, truth is when we go high, you go down on Putin? Mm. Sometimes I can't tell for which side you're rooting. When we go high, you go down on Putin. Uh, truth is, you're scared to lose. You got nothing in the bank that I I don't think we ever saw his tax returns, did we? You, 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 you white about balance like a bitch. But the only thing that's rigged is taxes for the rich. You're a free loan. Change your name to 
crap. My campaign grab enough. You can't get down a ramp. I'm pulling away faster than your wife's hand. For the love of democracy, <laughs> will you shut up, man? Will you sh just shut up, man? <laughs> Was this recorded and, and put out during the during the uh, during the election season? Is that why he's saying like my campaign's wrapping up? All right, that was solid. That was our first solid. Uh, I mean, they're all gonna be solid, and it's not even necessarily because of the raps themselves. I don't expect the raps to be crazy. They they are gonna have some bars in there, but it's really just the way that they do the videos that's super unique, and nobody could really copy this because it's like, oh, now you're just trying to be ERB. <laughs> but yo, that brings us to the end of this video, ladies and gentlemen. You like what you see? Consider liking the video, leaving a comment down below. You like what you see enough? Please consider subscribing. Longer form and com longer uh, longer form commentary is what we do around here. So if that's your vibe, hit the subscribe button. If you like what you see enough enough, and you are in a monetary capable position, consider supporting on Patreon or monetarily supporting on Twitch. You do get different benefits for both sides so check them both out if you want to support the channel mainly patreon is probably the best, best place to do it because you're gonna get like 20 30 extra videos a month that aren't gonna ever hit the channel but other than that appreciate your time go out there in the world love and care for one another love and care for each other catch everybody in the next video peace